All right, what's going on guys? This is another Guild Wars and we're gonna go ahead and get started here. So I've had a chance to look at some of the bases that we can attack. The first one is Black Onyx. I think it's a 230 might. There we go. Followed by that 227. Let's see here. So this one, let's see, pretty standard base. All right, let's see what we can do here. Drop my PD here, Cupid. Okay, let's see. Okay, my Michael went to the side. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Yeah, my PD's already dead. Just back out. How did my PD die? That was fast. All right, let's do it one more time. Oh, there's a space right there. I see. Oh, there you go. Activated that Medusa totem. And where else? Where else can we get a totem? Okay, I don't see any more gaps. But that was a mistake on his part. So good thing I had a chance to look that up. Okay, and then we're just gonna go all from this side and see how that works out. Ooh, don't get stunned. Oh no, I hate that Valentina. Okay, so even though our, val our heroes died in that Valentina proc, uh, we were still able to overcome those um, procs, and now we lost two heroes, which is not bad. And now I have to rehire more guardians and then let the uh, two heroes revive. But otherwise, that tough uh, top base for this Guild Wars was not hard at all. Okay, so that's one down. There we go. Okay, all right. I'll be right back. All right, what's going on, guys? I'm gonna attack the second uh, highest might here. And according to our guild member, he's actually pretty easy. So yeah, he looks like he's re reading. What? It's probably, I don't even know what the setup is, but regardless, we're gonna attack him. So here we go. Let me just take him on. Oh, there's a, uh, ooh, there's a Valentina totem that eliminated me right away. So we're going to back that for that one. Okay. And then we'll try to attack from the top then. Okay, so up here, oh, start off. Let's see how that goes. There we go. Let me just randomly drop him up. Oh, man. That's not that easy. Okay, so I have to think of another plan. My heroes just drop like flies. Okay, let's see. So I'll start off with my Aries Cupid. Okay, so now there's only a little nick left. And there we go. So did not lose any heroes, just lost some troops, and that's a good thing because I actually got attacked once for using troops. Let's see what it might look like. So I got attacked once, so good thing they're not coming in a rush yet to attack me. And there's no reason to because I am, like I said, only 164,000 might, so it's no big deal for them to attack me really. Unless they're low might, 227, 221, 212. 181, not coming back there, MXM, 222, so 222 is our next target, okay, it's MXM, let's go, okay, so there's a Valentina at the top, so, and then there's a Nick, so I gotta time this one right, okay, so I'm just gonna come up here, oh, PD there, keep it up here. Let's see if I can avoid that Valentina or that Corrode will target my. Uh, okay, oh, there we go. Valentina's gone. Valentina revived, but then he disappeared once my Warlock and Ares proc, and that's over. So that's good. All I need now, and I'm losing more troops, so that's good as well for defense because they're attacking me. So now. Just gonna wait it out. 
wish I have a fast forward button. Oh, there, nice totem. And there you go. That's the third highest might. So the next one here is 210. I think I saw something higher. Yeah. Let's see, okay. 210, let's see what's this one. 212. So I have a 212. Let's just make sure one more time. Dark Knights, dark. It's 206, okay. 206, this is 210. Okay, let me go to 212. I think my last two attacks will come here. Okay. Okay, so another Valentina, but this Valentina is only a 4 evite, so hopefully that doesn't hurt as much. And then I see that there's an Aries there. Let's see, there's that SK, so I want to attack from this SK side, so I can eliminate him right away. So what I can do is drop my Pumpkin Duke here, Cupid, followed by my Michael, and then the rest of my troops right here. There you go, see that SK is going to die, got caught in the Aries totem, I mean the Aries proc. My Pumpkin Duke dead. Okay, so I'm not lost Aries. Who else did I lose? Okay, so I lost Aries and Pumpkin Duke. That's not bad. And now I'm just going to clear out this base. So, okay, so this Guild War is not too bad. Just got one more base to attack. And since we dropped Might, I'd imagine that our top, the highest Might heroes on this Guild War is a little easier. Okay, so I'm completely out of troops. That's good. I'm not going to get attacked, hopefully, anymore. And then I just got one more to go, and that should be it. All right, I'll be right back. All right, guys, so this is my last attack here on 210. Okay, oh my gosh, this looks like another easy base. So we got lucky on the Guild Wars. So here we go. I don't want to speak too soon. But that's what it's going to look like. Okay. And my Archangel is doing work. Just pretty much annihilated his whole team. And that's all she wrote. Okay, good. That Medusa hit our troops. So I have less troops to get rid of. And that's pretty much it. So that's Guild Wars for this Sunday. And it's pretty much academic from here. Icy Baby 703, you're done. Alright, so that's Guild Wars for you. Top four bases on Black Onyx. And then, what was the other one? MXM. Oh, wait, I can't go in anymore because of. Uh, see, look, defense successful 16 times. And I had troops earlier, so now I'm going to get rid of my troops so that I don't lose any more. Uh, attacks. Let's see here. I got no troops. Oh, I'm still hiring a little bit. Take off that. Okay, so there you go. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Next time, I'll show you my free-to-play account and see how it's progressing. Bye-bye.